If you want to stay up to date with all current hip hop events and releases, make sure to subscribe and become part of this community. Oh, and also go cop that fresh merch and listen to my new album in the description. Okay, so there's these speculations out there that Drake was supposed to drop Scary Hours 3 today, so on June 10th. And there's a lot of stuff supporting this, a lot of stuff always, you know, still up in the air that we can't necessarily say is going to be real or not. But today I wanted to go over the, you know, over the couple of pieces of evidence that we have when it comes to scary hours three and what you know we can actually say about this thing still releasing because obviously it didn't drop today otherwise I would be making a whole nother video but there is still some stuff that's very interesting to look at so let's get straight into this so as I said there were these rumors that Drake was gonna drop something today and this was rumored to be scary hours three that's rumored to be like a new mixtape a new album whatever or just this little EP that is always scary hours and the the theme theory kind of behind it is that with the first two scary hours you know Drake dropped it in at the beginning of the year and the album came later on that year usually then in the summer and this worked with the first scary hours and then Scorpion and this also worked with scary hours 2 and then CLB later on in 2021 and so as people are expecting him to drop a new album in 2022 you know they're also expecting a scary hours 3 to happen and me myself included I've talked about this in the past as well talking about him getting some retribution for certified lover boy because that really was not it you know I, I don't like the album y'all really know that we went into depth on that one but uh, you know just to go over the the couple of pieces of evidence that we have that also support this claim so let's start off with the first one which is likely the one that got most people excited because it's just the most feasible one that we can just attach the most meaning to which is a post that he has live on his Instagram Instagram right now. It's a post cheering on the Scarborough Shooting Stars, which you know, J. Cole is playing for. We've made a video on that recently about the collab album between the two and the possibility of that happening. So make sure you go watch that video after this one. But when you scroll to the, to the, what is it, to the right, you know, to the second picture of this post, you can see him wearing a Scary Hours hoodie. And this is not like from, you know, some past time. This is not from Scary Hours 2, judging from also the hairstyle, because when Scary Hours 2 dropped, he still had the, the you know, the little heart hairstyle. This is pretty new. This is pretty up to date. And so he's wearing a Scary Hours hoodie in 2022. And around the time that he's also supposed to release Scary Hours 3. So this is the first hint that people immediately jumped on and were like, okay, something is coming. And in their defense, I gotta say that actually this also has me thinking that something is in the works. These, you know, that's like these subtle hints that artists give before an album is dropping, you know, posting some pictures with, you know, references to the album. But that's not all of it, because around the same time, over the past couple of days, a lot of leaks have surfaced, and this further supports the theory that Drake is in the studio right now working on music. And these leaks that we've gotten are very interesting. You can listen to a couple of them. There is one, for example, named Heated, um, which is more of a dancehall track, and this is also one of the theories that this new album, you know, is kind of like under, which is that this is going to be like a dancehall R&B type of album and that you know all the features on there are going to be like that so this is one of them and another one is just an untitled one but that one is more of a rap you know snippet and he's actually rapping on there which I did really enjoy and it does sound very dark so it could really fit into the theme of scary hours shout out to everybody especially Decon on the discord that posted these snippets in there if you're not yet make sure you're becoming a member of the discord of the best hip-hop community in the world in the description description right now because that's where all the leaks are posted and stuff like that also shout out my man Royce on the discord because he supplied me with some more information on this that I want to go over real quick so he also went over you know the the, the the hoodie that he was wearing he also went over the snippets that we've got but he also said that there's a lot of you know people that he's rumored to be working with for example J. Cole, Lil Baby, Benny the Butcher, Bad Bunny, French Montana, Lil Uzi, Tory Lanez and Beyonce and Beyonce is 
is also on one of the snippets. You know, I don't have it right now. I've been searching for it. Um, and, you know, Royce did send me a link to it. I can't open it, though. But, you know, Beyonce is on one of the snippets that's supposed to be one of these dance hall tracks. So that's, again, another hint as to this thing being like more of a dance hall record and also the features that are on there getting on these new types of, or not new, but on these dance hall types of instrumentals. Also, besides Beyonce, there were a couple of more snippets that featured French Montana and Uzi um, that just resurfaced on, on Twitter and on social media in general. So it's really weird how right now all of these leaks are releasing while before that there wasn't much talk of them, which is yet another hint, you know, towards it, as I said. Another, you know, thing that people were quick to pick up on, but I don't know if this is a little superstitious, but he changed his, you know, Spotify banner or like profile picture just to black. And I guess, you know, some artists do this right before they drop. I think Kendrick did it. I think Kanye did it. Um, but this doesn't have to mean anything, but it's definitely kind of suspicious that he's getting active on like his Spotify appearance, which usually artists do right before they're about to drop an album. So these are like the, you know, little little type of elements and puzzle pieces that we can put together as to Drake dropping Scary Hours 3. We don't have any actual confirmation on this. Um, you know, it didn't drop today, so that is kind of against the theory. But I did want all of y'all to know about this and get everyone caught up on what people were talking about because whenever there's, you know, Drake rumors, people are quick to jump on it. But I kind of wanted to put it in perspective and see this from like a bigger picture. But I do definitely think that there's a Scary Hours 3 coming out at some point. I don't know if it's going to be, you know, that soon, maybe for the summer, because otherwise Drake would not be wearing a Scary Hours hoodie in 2022 if there wasn't a Scary Hours coming out. And also, I, to my knowledge, the hoodie he was wearing is not like merch that you could previously purchase. So that, again, you know, is kind of a theory that uh, there's new merch for Scary Hours 3 coming out and he's wearing one of them right now. It would be perfect. That's how artists, like, usually promote and hype up their new album dropping. So that's something that I that I think is definitely, there's some, there's some substance to it. And it's kind of suspicious that all the leaks and snippets were coming out right around the same time as well. Um, but that, as I said, it's not definitive evidence that Scary Hours 3 is, in fact, coming. It's just some little puzzle pieces that people were putting together and saying, like, oh, it's coming out tonight obviously it didn't but I am looking forward to hearing it at some point in the future I don't know I don't actually think that Drake is dropping a whole album in 2022 um, but I do think a scary hours 3 EP or like a little mixtape like a 10 piece or something like that maybe one of those Tory Lanez capsules if he's going for an R&B dance hall type vibe um, that that's definitely something that I can see Drake dropping this year but I don't think a whole album but that would again tie in with the theory that he's dropping this very soon so I guess this is all up in the air let me know what you think about this I, I gave you all the information on this what do you make of this what do you make of the the hoodie he was wearing of the snippets resurfacing of the spotify bio or the, the profile picture or whatever and all the hints we got do you think drake is dropping scary hours three soon do you think it's not coming do you think a whole another album is coming all your thoughts and theories and opinions on this please let me know in the comments down below if you watched this video to the end and liked it and you want to stay up to date with all current hip hop events and releases, make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, hit that like button and go follow my social media and most importantly, join my discord in the description. Until the next one, you'll have an incredible day and you'll take care.